currently Friday, September, um, September 22nd. <laughs> so I'm currently chewing gum, so I'm sorry if that's gonna annoy you guys. Anyways though, I am basically ready to leave for Generation Beauty, and today is Friday, which means today is Creator Day. Creator Day of Generation Beauty is where like all the, basically like the beauty YouTubers and stuff come, and like we go to these seminars and everything, and then at nighttime they have a party. So me and Paige, you guys know Paige Shikoski, she's like one of my best YouTube friends. Um, She also lives in New York City, so we decided to go together. So we're going 10.30 to 4 to Creator Day, and then the party is 7 to 10. So I'm probably gonna go like 8 to 10. So that's that, but for my outfit today, show you guys what I'm wearing. So I'm wearing this choker, and this is from, I don't know where this is from, Kiss sent it to me though, but it's really, really cute, it's just gold. I'm also wearing my gold bar earrings. And then I'm wearing my blazer, and this blazer I got from, where did I get this from? I actually got it from JCPenney. I just got this little top tube top the other day, and I got this from Mystique Boutique. It's this place here in the city. And then, now I could whip out chair. Okay, you guys can't fully see me, but I'm wearing these black high-waisted jeans, and these are the Johnny jeans from, uh, what are these from? These are from Topshop, and they're just plain black, and they have a rip at the knee, so that's that. For my shoes, I am wearing these loafers, and these I got at Necessary Clothing, and I put a picture of these on my Twitter, like my entire outfit, and I Everybody thought they were real Gucci, uh, Gucci slippers, and I was like, um, I wish. But nah, they were like $20 necessary clothing, so if you want a good Gucci slipper dupe, you could go there. I'm sorry if you guys hear a bunch of background noise. They're doing construction here, as they literally always are every single day. But anyways, it is currently 10.08, which means I gotta rock and roll. So yeah, guys, so I ended up taking this bag instead because I feel like whenever I go to these, oh my God, look at this little string, no. I feel like whenever I go to these YouTube events, bringing a backpack just looks kind of unprofessional and I'm wearing a blazer right now. So I feel like this just goes a lot better. So uh, the fit currently, and we're about to leave. So let's go. So I'm just trying to walk to this subway and like I said, they're doing construction outside, but they're doing like major construction. I just had to walk around like three different things just to get to the other side. I walked to the other side of the street and then had to walk back. And then they were watering plants. So I kind of got my loafers a little wet. <sighs> great, 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 great. Coverfax lab um, and so we got this lab thing going on if it wants to focus it looks like this <laughs> and we're in the theater and apparently we're making like a custom foundation or something I had absolutely no idea what we were doing Paige had to tell me I was like we were required to do this I signed up and now I'm actually really happy <laughs> so that's gonna be really cool if we do make our own foundation it'll be awesome <laughs> hey guys we're at the cover effects lab like I told you before so these are the little pigments and stuff and the little station we're at it turns out this girl goes to FIT Hi. <laughs> what's your YouTube do you do YouTube or whatever um, or what do you I do, do Instagram Instagram, yeah. Instagram. what's your Instagram so mine's the art of lipstick and then I also co-run an Instagram undiscovered underscore M-U-A-S so <laughs> nice <laughs> kidding me right now? <laughs> Look how, oh my god. I gotta get that like string of chocolate. Wait. <laughs> Focus on the cookie. Oh my goodness, there we go. Ready guys, ready? Oh yes. <laughs> 
guys so i am back in my dorm because creator day has ended and i got my goodie bag and everything of some of my stuff and i also have the creator party tonight of course but right now i'm in my dorm i'm chilling i took my bra off because my bra was killing me and yeah not that i really need a bra with this top anyways but like whatever but anyways why is this light on so anyways um yeah so creator day was really fun you guys probably saw some clips um i can't actually flick a fidget spinner to oh wait did i do it me yeah i can't do it i gotta go <laughs> Anyways, though, Creator Day was really fun. You guys probably saw some clips before. And I'm going to do a quick little haul for you guys of the things that I got from Creator Day. And then later tonight, I'll do a little haul for you guys of the things that I got at um, the Creator Party. Anyways, the first thing I got is this beautiful Ipsy fidget spinner. Because, I don't know, they gave out these fidget spinners in the bags. And I don't own a fidget spinner. I feel like they're a cliche. And I don't want to own one. But honestly, this shit is so much fun. Like... Mm. All right, then we got an Ipsy pop socket, but I don't use pop sockets. I'm a big fan of the love handles, which is what I have on my phone, which are these things. I have a little lips one on right now, but I kind of just change them whenever I want. But I like this one better than the pop socket because the pop socket you have to hold on to, but the love handle holds on to you. So, like, you go like this with a love handle and, like, you go like wiggle it around and stuff and like it's not gonna fall if you do that with a pop socket it's gonna go flying out of your hand so that's why i like the love handles better i swear i'm like not being like paid to say that or anything um i really do like them and actually when i went to playlist live um i met the creator of the love handle and i became really good friends with him and he is awesome so maybe some beauty tricky love handles are coming out if you guys want a beauty tricky love handle then comment below and let me know because i could definitely reach out to him i have his number i could text him and be like yo collab bro anyways next thing i got some samples so this is the skin iceland solutions for stressed skin so this is the hydro cool firming face gels and this is for smile lines and this is the hydro cool firming eye gel so eye gel smile line gel stuff i don't know they're both like little face mask things and they're just like samples and i actually grabbed um i think like two more a couple more of those sky ones the eye gels because they were um giving them out for free so why wouldn't i grab free stuff anyways then i got this water bottle and i am a fan of reusable water bottles like i love them and i actually have one that looks exactly like this but these reusable water bottles are awesome and oh my god uh, this one says creator day on it how cute is that by ipsy but i literally have one of these look at this this one i got like just the other day riley rose sent this one to me the company and i love it i am such a sucker for reusable water bottles i have a swell bottle i also have a um what's it called um it's called a, a miku bottle or something i don't know it's like a fancy name but it's like a big one so i have a big water bottle a small one and this one is another small one so i am a really big fan of these because me and my roommates we use our uh burrito all the time and the burrito is basically like filters your water so I don't use like actual um water bottles like this and um excuse me while my mom calls me so I got this lime crime palette and this is actually not even released yet I think she said but I'm gonna open it up so I can show it to you guys it is their pocket candy palette but it looks like this it's super super cute and this is one of the three palettes that they have but it looks like this super cool shades I really like this like purpley mauve color in the corner and you can use these for eyeshadow um there's a contour color in there she said you can really use them like for everything so that's pretty cool and then better than sex mascara from Too Faced because this mascara is awesome and then from NYX I got this little lipstick and this is what is this I'm trying to get it out of the thing oh my god this is the NYX uh slip tease slip tease not strip tease it's a slip tease but this is oh this is a lip oil and then i also got the next cleansing milk which if you guys remember from my eye mats haul i actually bought this i was at eye mats and i really liked it so i got another one and i actually didn't bring it to the city with me but now i have one here so yeah what else do we have we have the pixie skin treats glow tonic and this is a exfoliating toner we have the uh, color effects natural finish foundation which actually we did if you guys saw we did like this um last thing with for cover effects where we created our own custom foundation shade and so I made mine I think this matches my shade pretty well and I made it by hand so that was cool but they also give you a full size of the foundation in your shade which was cool I got a mask and this is the super medic poreless carbo carbonic peel and this is from a company called like best fens or something I don't know what's called best friend 
best friend not best friends but best friend also got a glow tonic to go exfoliating toner pads so that's the same thing as the pixie thing and then also kendra scott um we got to make our own like necklace things so we got these necklaces this is the little thing oh the necklace is at like the very bottom oh my god the necklace didn't even come out but it looks like this super pretty and this is just like a white stone with some glitter on it and it's silver and super super cute so i absolutely love that and then we got a pixie palette this is the strobe and bronze glow and bronze palette you guys can't see it there you go this is the skin iceland this is their arctic hydration rubberizing mask so actually the girl was talking about this it's one of those masks that like you apply and then when you peel it off it's like rubber so that's pretty cool and then i also got the cover effects perfect setting powder it's from a company called innis free and this is an intensive hydrating serum pore clearing clay mask and hydrating sleeping mask and then there's also some other things in here this is the it's real squeeze mask and then um it's real squeeze mask again so two of them i guess and then another thing from kendra scott and this is the last thing and this it says is a nail polish so i'm like dying to open it up well actually i'm not gonna open it but it's like yellow you can see it and then of course we got the cute little ipsy bag and there's also a bag we got from nyx that's right here so that's pretty cute and yeah that's like my little haul oh wait there's something else in here i just heard it oh this is just an essential oil they did like a meditation session so they gave everybody lavender essential oils and this smells so damn good but like i mean i don't really use essential oils so yeah i just heard my phone vibrate i don't know if that was a phone call or a text message it was a text message from my boo by the way if you guys haven't heard their new song why don't we invitation go listen to it and pre-order the ep uh he just texted me saying that he's on his way to jfk um airport and i don't know why because jfk is about like 30 minutes from me so what you doing there boy oh he said they're flying back to la from there so i if i were to go he said i don't know if you want to meet me there for a second but uh, it would take me, like, an hour. Maybe I'll go. Spontaneous adventure to JFK airport to see my boyfriend. I mean, I have nothing to do, so I might as well go. Um, I mean, all I was gonna do is clean up my room and then go to this chocolate place called Royce. Really, really good chocolate. They have this matcha green tea chocolate. It's so good. I don't know, maybe I'll start cleaning this stuff up, and when he texts me back of what time they'll be there, um, I guess it'll determine... If I'm going or not, but um, yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna clean up everything, and we'll see what happens if I go and see him for a little bit or not. Um, but yeah. All right, guys, I made the decision that I'm gonna go, and I'm gonna go to JFK for like 10 minutes and see Corbin. Um, I know it's like totally out of the way. It's like an hour away from here, but it's not that bad to actually get there. You just take the train to Jamaica and then the air train to JFK, um, to whatever terminal. Um. But yeah, I want to see him, and I don't know how long it's going to be until I see him. Like, that's the only thing that sucks about being in a long distance, not just with, like, any person, but specifically with him, because he's always traveling for his music and stuff, so I never actually know when the next time I'm going to see him is, because I don't know if they're going to be on tour, if they're going to be flying somewhere else, if they're going to be in L.A., like... I don't really know anything, um, and he doesn't really find out about any of his travels till, like, a couple days before. Um, so both of us are kind of clueless as to when we, like, see each other. We don't really, like, know. So anytime that I get a chance to see him, um, I like to take up on the opportunity. And, I mean, I'm only gonna see him for, like, ten minutes, but... It's okay. It'll be worth it. But yeah, I am wearing this cardigan now. I decided I'm going to go a little more casual. I'm just wearing a cardigan, and I'm still wearing my loafers and the same top as before. I'm keeping my hair up, though. And yeah, I got my little backpack packed because it's what I bring everywhere with me. You guys know I use my backpack purse. Um, and I'm going to leave in, like, a minute. I just got to grab my card, lock up, and I'll be on my way. So I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. I literally cannot believe I'm doing this, guys. I don't even know I'm in focus right now, but this is one of the most spontaneous things I've done since being here. I've done a lot of spontaneous things, a lot of really weird things, but this definitely has to top them because I was literally just informed about 20 minutes ago, and 20 minutes later, I'm walking to Penn Station. <laughs> Guys, I am finally at 
JFK and Gordon just texted me that he's here. Um, he said he's in a black Sprinter van, but I ain't seen no damn black Sprinter van unless, is this it? He said it's a Mercedes Sprinter van. I'm not too sure, but I mean, I'm looking, I'm looking. Uh, I don't know. I ain't seen, is it? Wait, is that it? Nope, that is a regular Sprinter van. Damn it, I don't know where it is. Hello! Hi! Hi! Uh, hello! On his boosted board right now, holding his pillow. I'm gonna boost and board my way through. She said pillow. Is it a pillow or a pillow? It's a pillow. It's a pillow. She called it a pillow. It's a, hey, you I'm riding your. I'm riding your boosted board. I feel like if I. Alright, guys. So. Hi, vlog. <laughs> so Corbin's asking that guy up there if he could get me through to the gate, and then no just way. before. Yeah, and then until you guys take off, and when you take There's off, no I'll just way. leave. Not Thank you, Will. I, I don't know. Like, like, I hope. I hope. Nice. He's gonna try. He's Corbin's like asking vlog. him to hey, try vlog. and say, "Oh, I just saw him." Shuffle. And hi. I just saw him. I just saw I'm Jack. Yeah. You're supposed yeah. to say, say and no. hi. Oh wow. So now All right, guys. So. Um, that guy tried actually the reason I got tried was because he, uh, some fans showed up some live lights and their dad worked for TSA But he couldn't get me through because I needed a boarding pass, but it's totally okay um, I'm just heading back now Kind of sad. I'm always sad when I leave Corbin, but I mean it was only for like 10 minutes and I'm glad I got to see him anyways, and I have generation beauty tonight anyways, and I might be seeing him in like two weeks Which is like so good But it's a maybe so Hey guys, so I am back in my dorm, but I'm actually leaving. Um, yeah, so my Uber is right outside, I believe, and now I'm going to the Gen Beauty party. So that means I'm leaving, and yeah, it's gonna be fun. I'm meeting back up with Paige, and yeah, fun stuff. All right, guys, so me, Paige, and Menora, hi, I'm vlogging about how pissed we are. Okay, so. <laughs> We get to, oh my god, I'm not even focused, there we go. We get to the lounge club PhD thing or whatever, wherever they're having the party. It's in the exact same place, exact same room as last year. So this year they're not letting people in that aren't 21. Why would you give a pass to a creator that isn't 21 in the first place and then make them show up to tell them that they're not even allowed in? They're literally like, oh, you go grab your goodie bag in like the room before you walk in and then leave. So they're making people that are under 21 get a goodie bag and then leave? Like, are you kidding me right now? It was not like this last year. I'm really pissed about that. So, I mean, now we're just going to Uber back, I guess. But, like, I mean, we got the goodie bag, which is good. But, like, yeah, it's a big-ass bag. But, like, are you kidding me? Like, I don't know. Some bullshit, guys. That's all. Oh, my God, guys. We are almost at... 400,000 subscribers. I am like dying right now. I'm like tweeting you guys crazy and stuff and I cannot believe this. Look how fast it's going. We're literally like 10 away. I'm gonna say 10 away. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I am so excited. I'm so sad nobody's here to celebrate with me, but like I'll call my dad, I guess. Oh my goodness gracious. Did I get the screenshot? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Are you fucking kidding me right now? Whoever just unsubscribed is a real asshole. Oh, I'm just kidding! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my goodness gracious, we just hit 400,000 subscribers. I am freaking out right now. Thank you guys so much. I'm so happy. And oh my god, like seriously, uh, obviously this wouldn't happen if it wasn't for you guys because you guys are awesome and you're loyal and you subscribe and you follow and watch my videos and just thank you so much. I'm so happy right now. I actually promised my roommates that I would get them a, um, uh, ice cream cake for all of us to celebrate when I hit 400,000 and we knew we were gonna hit this weekend So I was like alright, I guess when you guys get back on Monday, I'll get the cake, but whatever Thank you guys so much I'm honestly so grateful for everything that YouTube has given me whether it's you know You guys is like fans and stuff and like chickies like I love each and every one of you You know the opportunities that doing YouTube has like Given like the opportunities that I got from doing YouTube and from having such amazing following has just been Absolutely amazing and I cannot wait to continue my YouTube journey and just 
keep growing myself and honestly when like things like this happen like milestones it really just pumps me up and makes me that much more motivated to make amazing content for you guys so i really just cannot wait um for the future and just thank you so so much we're literally this means that we are 100,000 away from 500,000 subscribers that is half a million subscribers have i ever thought i would ever get there in my life fuck no i never would have thought that i would get to five to five that subscribers. I mean, I'm at 400,000 now, but literally we are 100,000 away from a half a million subscribers. That is absolutely insane. And I'm just like, oh my God, I'm so mind blown right now. I'd be so happy. So thank you guys for everything. And I still got to do my little, um, my little ipsy haul um, for you guys, the Generation Beauty thing. I actually had to stop my camera because it was dying, but I was like, oh my god, I gotta charge the battery a little bit, and then I started hitting 400,000, I was like, about to hit it, so I'm like, I gotta take the battery out, and now I'm gonna charge it a little bit more, and then like 10 minutes of the haul for you guys. Um, but, oh my god, this is absolutely insane. Thank you guys so much, I'm gonna stop blabbering. But, um, yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Mwah. All right, guys, so I just got off you now. Um, I went on you now because I have 400,000 subscribers, so I was like, let me do that first before I do this haul, so now I'm gonna to show you guys everything I got um so yeah let's just dig in okay guys so I put my little bag right here and as I take the things out I'm just gonna like put them on the counter so let's dig in so the first thing we have here is the skin fix what is this the foaming clay cleanser I'm just gonna go by everything really fastly because Rafe really fastly really fast because there's a lot of things in here so um yeah and then we have the royal Nicole moda complexion perfection which i love royal Nicole brushes you guys know that i am obsessed with their brushes and this has a powder concealer and flat top foundation brush in it we have this thing and what is this oh this is the nude sticks these were at um gem beauty last year i got a couple of these magnetic matte lip color what does it mean by magnetic do they mean metallic no it says magnetic and then it comes with a little sharpener All right and then there's this this is the what is this this is the nose perfector from luxie and jd weighty 180 <laughs> jd weighty 180 that's funny so i guess it's like a um what's it called it's like a collaboration thing and it's a brush and then we have the belief moisturizing eye balm we have the Rimmel London shake it fresh clump free volume mascara which I actually have this and I haven't used it so I don't know this is awesome this is from the balm this is their nude beach palette which I love the balm so this comes like a bunch of different shades and then we have the Ilure and Nikki Phillip collection um these are some lashes and these are midnight meow and then we have this little thing and this is from absolute and it has a uh, confetti on the inside which is kind of annoying because now there's gonna be confetti everywhere these are their starry eyed shimmering liquid eyeliners so this one is in solar this one is in supernova and this one is in dark side so we have a pink one a gold one and a black one and then we have this what is this, this is by Ofra this is their long lasting liquid lipstick trio and this is actually something separate i thought it was stuck together but it's not yeah it comes with three different shades in here and it doesn't actually tell you the shades on the thing i guess you just have to take them out this one is in mocha this one is in amsterdam and this one is in milan then this is from catrice cosmetics which i'm actually going to like this spa thing with them tomorrow so that's really cool inside of here they have their all round concealers this concealer palette they have the brow to Definer, long lasting brow definer the volumizing lip booster so like a lip gloss beautifying lip smoother so this is a lip balm and then their glam doll curl and volume mascara and then there's a little thing in here for 20% off and then we got the brow food aqua brow powder and pencil duo so it looks like that then we have the was this the note BB lip corrector oh this is from I remember this brand this is dirty little secret and this is is in the color spiced latte i don't know exactly what it is though oh it's a lip gloss it's like a pretty peachy pink shade and then we have an eyeshadow palette and this is from covergirl jewels this is their jewels palette we have the define me clara fragrance oil which define me actually has sent me a package before of their essential oils and like they're really really nice and you can like mix them to create your own scent this is the derma e illuminating rose hip and cranberry face oil this is the shia moisture smooth and tame blowout cream so you put this in your hair before you give yourself a blowout there's a little thing inside of 
package here. This is from Pure Lease. Oh my god, I remember I got like these face masks from them last year and they were awesome. So this comes with their blue lotus seed mud mask and exfoliant. And then there is a little thing by Essence and it's in this nice little package. So they have their color correcting mattifying powder, satin touch blush, their rock and doll duo stylist eyeliner pencil. This is a lipstick, the Vibrant Shop lipstick and it's a purple lipstick. This is their Lash Princess False Lash Effect Mascara. And then their Light Up Your Face Luminizer Palette. And then we have the Pixie Peel and Polish. This is a resurfacing concentrate. I wonder what the hell that means. Oh, it's an enzyme peel. So I guess you like peel it off your face or something. Like how do you leave on for up to two minutes and then rinse off and pat dry. Then what's this? Oh, this is some NYX stuff. All right, so first we have this Cake That powdered eyeliner. We also have a eyeliner brush, and then their Slip Tease lipstick, which I got one of these earlier, and this one is in Vacation. Then we have this. This is the Marc Anthony Refreshing Coconut Clear Dry Shampoo. This is the, what is this, the OGX. I've heard this brand before. This is the OGX Orchid Oil. Then we have the Trustique. What is this? Matte Color and Shiny Balm. And this is in Barcelona Bright Berry. Barcelona Bright Berry. It says two different things. Like this. And we have this. And this looks like it was like <laughs> opened and stuff. Like it was like it got messed up, I guess. But this is a, this is a phone selfie light. I actually already own one of these. That's pretty funny. So I guess I'll like give this to like one of my roommates or something. Because I already have one of those. And then I have this. And look at this. It has a little watermelon on it. So cute. From a brand called glow recipe and there is a blueberry bounce gentle cleanser and there is also something else in here if it wants to come out of the packaging this is their watermelon glow sleeping mask if this is watermelon it better smell like watermelon it smells like watermelon we have this big thing what is this this is a hydration recovery aerating gel mask and this is from Lum lumian lumian another big thing what is this this is the, what is this, Bio Peel Gauze Peeling Lemon. After cleansing, use one gauze to gently sweep across a dry face and neck with an inward motion, avoiding eye area. Apply more to problem areas and rinse with lukewarm water. Follow with your daily toning. Oh, so I guess this is maybe like some sort of like, um, I want to say like a cleanser, I think. It's like a cleanser. I'm not sure. All right, next we have Physician's Formula. I have my leg up now, guys, so like don't mind me. This is their Butter Blush, and this is in the shade Natural Glow. And we also have, oh my god, this is so cute. Their City Glow Bronzer, and look at it, it has a New York skyline on it in gold, and it says New York. How freaking cute. And then we have the Tardis Pro Glow Palette. It. Oh my god, I'm so excited about this one. This is freaking awesome. So you open it up and they have a bunch of different glowing colors. How awesome is that? It looks like there's like a cream in here too. There's like a cream contour, so that's pretty fancy. And then there's two things that I just pulled out. Oh my god, the Their Real Mascara from Benefit. I am obsessed with this mascara. I love that, so I'm excited about that. This is the Face Magnet Primer from Pop Beauty. Then we have the... Koki nail polish and this is in the color I don't know it doesn't say a color actually but it's like you can see from there it's like a kind of like bluish shade then we have the egoism mac mat not mac this is the matte velvet lipstick and this is from kiss which i really like kiss i work with them a lot and this is the mark anthony grow long rapid glow leave-in um so i guess this like helps like grow your hair we have the eva nyc main magnet 10 in 1 primer for your hair this is the tarte rainforest of the sea eyeshadow palette oh my god i'm obsessed with tarte products so i am hype about all these products this is what it looks like how good is that super super cute oh my god they have mac this is the mac eyeshadow this is a mac eyeshadow one called burgundy times nine so it's like a burgundy palette how pretty is that this is the ciate oh my god i never know how to pronounce this but it's like that nail brand and this is actually a mascara from them i didn't know they come out with beauty products this is from artiste 
and isn't that piece like that brush brand unless I'm going crazy and this is not that I think this is just like a little mirror is it not like I can't open it oh my god yeah it's like a little mirror but it looks like a clutch how cute and then we have the pure cosmetics lip gloss in the color tickled this is another thing from Ciate brand and this is their dewy stick luminous highlighting balm and then we have the Brio Geo blow dry perfection heat protection so another like blow dry cream we have oh my god these are the Gumi markless hair loops these are kind of like um oh my god what the hell are they called these are exactly like the invisible if you guys ever seen the invisible hair ties these are exactly those and there's like a lot of them in here this is the winky lux this must be a lipstick oh my god this is a lipstick with like the rose inside like you guys know those lipsticks with the rose inside oh my god look how pretty it is oh my god i've always wanted one of these lipsticks how freaking cute then we have the lancome moisture oh monsieur big mascara so more mascara this is the mac metallic lipstick in the color foiled rose and i want to see this because i kind of really like mac lipsticks so <gasps> Oh my god, this looks exactly like heroin, but like a like glittery version of heroin, which heroin is another lipstick from MAC that I really like. Then we have the Tristique, what is this, mini crayon quad. It looks like a box of crayons. That's so cute. When it comes with like these little lip crayons, that's so cute. We have the Lock Color, what is this, the Lock Color Lock It Cushion Lip Pen. Then we have some stuff from, oh my god, I can never see this brand too. This is Jouir, Ju. Jewer? I don't know what this is called. We have a long wear lip cream and this is in the color rose gold So I gotta crack this open because rose gold and the packaging is so pretty Oh, it's not like as rose gold as I expected it to be and then we have two of their high pigment glosses And this one is in Shibuya Shibuya. Oh, it's like a nice red and we have another one in Park Avenue Ooh, Park Avenue is here. It's on the east side and it looks like that then there are two of their long wear lip creams and this one is in noise noise and this other one is in skinny dip and it looks like that that's really pretty i like this one a lot and there's only three more things left in here and two of them are mac but actually this one is makeup forever and this is in the color oh this is their artist liquid matte and this is in the shade 1009 and then we have the mac prep and prime lip base and then we have a mac retro matte liquid lip and this is in the color high drama it's like this red color so shout out to all of these brands and to generation Beauty for hooking us up this is actually a bowl of chicken rice soup that belongs there but i used it as a tripod but thank you so much to Ipsy for all this stuff and to all the brands for just like coming together and making this amazing goodie bag for all the creators. It's so amazing being able to go and get all of this like stuff. There's just so much. So thank you so much to them. So I just laid everything out on the table that I got and holy shit, like a white. And with that being said, with that little haul, I'm gonna go uh, to bed now because I'm really tired. So I gotta remove my makeup and I wanna edit this vlog so it goes up tomorrow on time. And yeah, so I'll talk to you guys in tomorrow's vlog because I will be vlogging Gem Beauty tomorrow. And yeah, so I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. So ciao, ciao, chickies. Mwah.